Hi guys, so today I'm going to do my September project pan finale and I know it is the middle of October so this is definitely a fail in, in more than one way but I really want to get this filmed, get it up so that there's a little bit of consistency and then I will be filming like an October project pan introduction even though technically it's kind of where the update is, um, should be but anyways, my September project pan finale um, there are some lots of good progress considering it's like half a month late. The first thing I did actually finish in September and it's the e.l.f. contouring blush and bronzer. It just looks like this. You can see that there was a bronzer over here. Let's see if I can get any of the, or is it just going to be? There's bronzer and then a blush over here and I'm really happy to have this out of my life. I've had it for such a long time and I've just had products for such a long time that while I enjoyed it, the bronzer wasn't my favorite. It was definitely really, really dark um, and I've been enjoying playing with a different bronzer now. Um, and the blush was okay. These, these weren't my favorite. I wouldn't run out and purchase them. They were good quality, just not the colors for me. So there's that. The second thing that took a little bit into October to finish, but it is finished now, it's the Revlon Illuminates Cream Shadow in Seashells. So there are just four cream eyeshadows and they are all gone. Um, I had a little bit left and they really started irritating my eyes, so I just cleaned them out, um, to be honest, but... I'm not going to wear anything that irritates my eyes. These are my oldest cream shadows. That's why I picked them. Um, I kind of have the dates of when I purchased everything. And I'm starting to kind of, some in some categories, go for the like older ones just to see do they st do they still work do they hurt my eyes like this like the consistency was great still and everything and the smell but when they start hurting your eyes obviously it's time for it to go but um, I had used 99% of it I was just trying to get around the edges when that happened so there's another product done that I've had for such a long time the third product that I finished is this elf all over color stick in pink lemonade and I actually used it for the last time today um, but as you can see there's this plastic ring around it and so when I've used it the last couple days I've been like scraping I feel like I'm scraping my face a little bit with that ring and so it's just not uncom it's just uncomfortable now and so again just not worth it this is a dollar and it has great great pigmentation I just don't know I go back and forth with cream blush and I like it. I want maybe one, but this is a little bright for all year round. I just want more of a natural one. Um, but this is great if you want a cream blush, if you want to try them out. I like that they're in the stick form because I just went like this and then rubbed it in. I didn't have to use my fingers. Um, you could use your fingers or a brush if you really wanted to, but um, I like that I didn't have to. I felt like I got more, was able to get more um, even application that way but like I said up to you the next thing is something I'm still working on it is a lip balm uh, I'm trying to use it every day um, as you know I wear lip products down really strangely and so there's that the last three products I don't have with me I know what they are and I know if I finish them but I just cannot find them I feel like I put them all in one spot like when I was changing them out but I don't know where they went the first one was a bare minerals um, lip gloss in Miami Beach and it is finished it is done and I'm really excited about it so I have another lip gloss and then I had a steel lip glaze in lights I believe it was kind of a nude um, a little bit of darker nude lip gloss it is gone as well um, and then the third one was an elf naturally nymph lipstick I believe and I didn't finish it I have just a little bit left so probably um, I might try it in the winter, but it probably will be more of a spring and summer. Just pull it out again and really just use it up. Um, but I was really happy with all the progress that I made. And so, like I said, in October, I was going to pull out some like brighter lips and things like that just to change it up. And so I have, and you will see that in my October Project Pan introduction, which will be going up next. Like I said, I'm really, really sorry for the hiatus, but I've been sick on the weekends and we had like parent-teacher conferences and then just being tired. I just haven't had a chance and um, to do it because when I come home from work, I don't get home till like 
and a lot of times I don't want to redo my makeup or I have things going on in the evenings and so it's really hard to film like in the evenings so I have to do on the weekend and so my weekends get filled or I'm sick like I was last weekend filming just went out the window so I'm really really apologizing I'm going to film three videos today so you should be seeing a little bit more consistent videos um and like I said, I'm feeling a little, a little bit better. You can tell my voice is still not 100%. But, um, yeah, like I said, the October Project Pan introduction will be up next. Bye!